So the Pioneers programme is designed to support a range of social businesses. Uh, we're now in the second year of the programme and have supported 45 different organisations. So it's something that we're really keen to use our skills and expertise to really help those organisations grow to scale. The opportunity to work with start-up businesses, talk directly as a relatively junior person to the CEO in a one-on-one -on -one situation, it's a great position to be in great experience. In some respects the challenges are just the same so it's looking and saying how can you take what you know and what you do every day adapt and flex that to what a social enterprise might need and who else in the organization could they tap into to get the best of Deloitte in that in that respect. The pioneers were deliberately selected from a variety of different industry segments to allow us to really bring to bear um, our different industry expertise. A real good example of where this has worked is with our healthcare practice and Patients Know Best who have jointly been working together on a number of client bids which is a win-win for both sides. The system was about giving the patient not just access to the data but control of the data. When you do that the patient makes the healthcare system more efficient. The project I'm working on is a two-year pilot and the idea is to move HIV care out of hospitals and into primary care to give patients access to their clinical notes, to their blood results and this enables patients to be more um, self-directed. The next six months is basically learning as much as we can from the Deloitte team but also as we tell them about the different work we're doing and they continue their due diligence with us and their capacity building with us. We're actually looking at contracts where we both make money from the content and that's where basically we go between from a one year um, CSR uh, program where we've greatly benefited to a longer term partnership which we hope to be a part of um, where Deloitte and Patients Their Best are working uh, across the UK. Blue is made with mineral water and ethics. For us it's first and foremost about being an environmental brand and then we trade sustainably, we make profits, and all of our profits go to water aid. So we're not a charity water, we're an ethical water. Well, we signed up to the Deloitte program uh, because it had a fantastic track record for actually delivering results. We have already seen some, uh, some development in specific market areas, retail catering, where we would normally not get our hands on ourselves. Now, a lot of what we've been doing is helping formulate the strategy for Blue. Obviously, it's led by an entrepreneur, so there's plenty of ideas there. It's the prioritisation and discipline of implementation that, that we sort of brought a bit more weight to. I set up Viability uh, when I was studying for an MBA in Football Industries. Our approach is different because it brings the commercialisation of football and the community aspect together. About a year ago we took two, two guys from within our programme on Jobs Growth Wales placements um, and working with Viability we made their placements sustainable. Uh, 18 months ago they were both living on the street and homeless you know so that's a huge impact for us. So we're helping them look at alternative ways of generating revenue so we've used our Deloitte digital practice to create them a prototype app and currently we're helping them create a business plan and an approach to then seek further funding to complete that. I was on a high after representing Wales at uh, the Homeless World Cup and I wanted to get back into work and thankfully Viability came along and offered us a job. So. By doing that scaling up we can engage more people and by engaging people we know we will change their lives. The really exciting thing about the Deloitte programme is the extent to which they've really embedded it across the business and embraced the whole business in the way that it works. So it's not just a programme where they're offering a business support and mentoring, although they're doing that and they're really using their skills really effectively in that way. Um, but it's also the way that they're pulling in other bits of the business to really um, help them both in terms of their procurement and how they're buying uh, and really demonstrating that they're a socially responsible business and they're looking to demonstrate that in through their business activity as well as just through their, their CSR activity, which is really exciting, I think, from a business perspective.